Hello, this time we are going to make a slippery ice floor. First, prepare the material to be applied to the floor. The ice material shown in the video can be made by watching the tutorial on our channel. Click the Blueprint Add button in the detail of the floor mesh to make a blueprint. Next, click the Add Component button to create a box collision. Next, adjust the scale and box extent values in box collisions detail to set the size of the box collision. Next, create a collision event by creating a begin overlap node and an end overlap node in box collision. Create two cast to third person character nodes for casting and connect them to the begin overlap and end overlap nodes. Drag pins from them to create a character movement node to get the character's movement related value. From the Character Movement node, create a Set Ground Friction node and a Set Breaking Deceleration node. Set the values of the created nodes as shown in the video to set the friction and breaking values of the original character. Next, duplicate the Set Ground Friction node and the Set Breaking Deceleration node and connect them to the Begin Overlap node. Then create two float type variables. The names and values of the two variables are set as in the video. Click the eye next to the variable to make it possible to set the variable outside of the blueprint as well. Finally, bring two variables to the event graph and connect them to the set ground friction node and set breaking deceleration node respectively as shown in the video so that when the character is in the collision event area, the character's movement is affected by these values. Now if we play, we can see that the character slides as he runs on the ice material.